Good morning, guys. It's about 1 p.m. and I have not slept. <laughs> My husband is still sleeping. He's going on 12 hours of sleep. Oh, I think he's awake. He's alive! Poor baby's getting sick. <laughs> Look, Amazon treasure truck. Okay, we'll go check it out today. They have a, uh, so you find a truck, <coughs> Amazon warehouse. You wanna go check it out? Sure. Are you okay to go? You're like super sick. Yeah, we'll so should I sleep on the couch or what? Mm -hmm. No, I'm serious. So should I sleep on the couch from no. now on? No, I should be okay. It's just been coughs. Just put on a sweater, please. My husband just, he doesn't think that, that the breeze affects, but it really does. Just a little bit and it, you just, mm. you know? Just please put on a sweater. Mm. My husband's getting ready and we're gonna go to Amazon and pick up some stuff and um, I'm gonna try to stay up all day so that I can crash tonight. Cause I don't wanna sleep now and then be awake in the middle of the night. So let's try to keep a, a strong um, focus on staying awake. Cause I feel like my body's starting to crash right about now. But, yes, I hear my husband in the restroom and I think he's definitely getting sick for sure, for sure. So we're gonna get him some medicine because I don't wanna take any chances. Hubby just bought some formula for the baby. This is a uh, Similac. And uh, it's Pro Advanced. Um, we got both Similac and Infamils. So we'll test it out and see if which one is better for the baby. For now, we're gonna seal it up and um, put it away till baby comes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know how long these three caps will last? How long? A month. A month after opening? No, I meant the baby's gonna eat up so much that each of these is like 10 days worth of supply. Oh wow. It we'll depends just... on how old he is. But... And he's putting it into pooper scoopers. Stash right here. Okay. Here we are, the treasure truck. First steps, baby registry. So cute. Okay, where to? Huh? The other way? This um, way? Um, center. Here it is, the treasure truck. Amazon. Entrance right here. <coughs> Let's see what's good in here. First booth is this one right here. Simple Joys by Carter's. You can customize your baby's clothes, put his name on it. I'm gonna do this. They allow three litters on the sheep right here. Okay. And my husband's gonna do this and he's gonna put poo. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cute? They have a poo um, emoji on them. <laughs> We have baby cribs over here, strollers over there, um, these little midway hanging chairs, and drinks over here. Brian wants to get a drink right now. Mixed mingo. Bubbly. What's up, guys? Hi. There's some mocktails here. We have three different flavors of uh, mango, strawberry, and grapefruit. Mm hmm. They have a. Um, Grapefruit. We got the uh, grapefruit right here. Check out the uh, fruit. I think that's a lychee. Let's try it out. It's a piece flavored, of banana. Flavored water. Is that banana? I'm just kidding. <laughs> I hate bananas. Moon and back. Look at all these sheep. Let's go see the clothes over here. I feel like I like the um, onesies with the zippers more because it's a hassle. Aww. So we're gonna try to look for that instead and save some time, some issues. Like this one right here. Babe, we need to get something like this because this one has zippers and it'll save you lots and lots of time. What do you mean? The other one just button. Yeah, but baby moves a lot. So, oh, look at this. So he's gonna like, you know. Oh, girls. So cute. 
cute. Zippers, zippers. That's what we're looking for. Unicorn! So, um, look out for zippers, okay? Okay. Oh. Hi! Hi! We have this cool toy. Oh. Elephant! Yeah. Rabbit! Oh. Ducks! chicks good night my baby and soundly sleep you safe in my arms I'll always keep drift off to a world of wonderful dreams until you awake with morning sunbeams here we have the baby tubs where they can just uh, shower in make sure that they uh, don't drown this is super cute This is basically just wash up and cleanliness. Oh, Nemo, Turtle, Turtle, Dora. This booth has clouds. Very, very cute. They gave us free socks and diapers and wipes. So you can just scan it and put it on your Amazon registry. We're just here to look and see what we need. In here we have the baby changing boots. Diaper. <laughs> then we have um, cleanliness stuff, sheeps, and clouds. Aww. So this is what Brian got. I'm not sure if the, it's the same exact one, but he bought this already and I told him not to because I was going to do all the purchasing for the text, but um, I think these are all the different types, Brian. Yeah, I don't know. I got um, that one. You got this one? The black one? So we got classic nylon fabric with five unique motions. We might need this one right here. Baby Shusha. <laughs> Keep the baby quiet. And this one we might need the outlet to check if the baby is okay when he's sleeping. Um, this prevents SIDS, sudden death. Hubby's back in the treat area. <laughs> I told you he has a sweet tooth and it passed on to my belly. You are definitely the one that's giving me the sweet tooth. Seriously. Bubbly just water. That's not water. I said bubbly just water. So Here. what's this? Um, pita chips. <laughs> five cheeses. Here. Alright. Breakfast for us. So they offer bubbly sparkling water and some um, pita chips for you to hang out while you're here. Or a snack on while you're here. <laughs> I guess it's break time. I got myself the garlic and herbs pita chips. This is by Stacy's. And uh, we're just uh, kind of um, doing some research on our phones and deciding what we actually need for the baby and the parent. I got this. What, which one is this one? Strawberry mocktail. This one is the strawberry one. I think Brian wants to try all the flavors before we go. Are we here for baby or are we here for snacks? <gasps> good. I like those. Okay, here. And we just grab the whole grain bites. This is in the flavor strawberry. This is the kitchen area. Look how cute. Oh my goodness. And salt and pepper. I don't know if kids really need that, but I want to get this because the nipples are kind of like um, the actual mom's nipples or it feels like it they say some babies can take it some don't I wish they had a blue though I don't I'm not sure about the green we have the high chairs more baby bottles less 
wine. What's going on here? It's not baby stuff. Here we have oh, baby bretza. This is a food processor, Brian, to make food when the baby starts to eat. Solids. And we have fake paws and pants. This is kind of like tall for kids. It's like normal height. What's that? Oh, for kids to like pick? Basically, it gets snacks and it doesn't fall out. And a cute little table over here. I don't know if this is for decorations, but can kids eat with this? No, it's designed. Maybe just to play? Just decoration. These are cool because they're magnets, Brian. Look, so he can't like take his food off or his plate and then throw food. You know what I mean? There? Yeah, so it's like stuck. Ugh. And then the food uh, sticks here. It's not a magnet. Oh, it's a suction. It's just a suction, yeah. Yeah, but they have some that are magnets. This one? I've suction. seen some. I've seen some that are magnets. Do you want magnets or you want suction? Uh, whatever's easier. I think suction's fine. Over here we have these baby um, thingies. I don't know what they're called, but it helps baby walk and stand on his feet play with things that's the ocean this is the jungle i suppose and this one must be also the ocean shuck, 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 shuck. we have more baby thing things this is the jungle everything's jungle and woodland creatures and under the water Where should we go today, my child? Somewhere far and strange and wild. I don't care where or what we see as long as you're right here with me. There's so many to choose from. I have no idea which one to buy. More strollers. I think we're set on the Duna. So, um... <laughs> This is just to browse and see. This one's a very simple one, not too crazy. And here we have the car seats. So many options, choices. My husband just picked up the two uh, onesies. Poo and Zzz. <laughs> Why the poo? Because he poos a lot or what? Pooper. Oh, oh I see. <laughs> we are done here. That was very interesting. Last thing is to check out this treasure truck. I think you just um, get something for playing, I suppose. Find everything you need for swaddling, swimming, strolling, and snuggling. Are you guys signed up with the treasure truck already? Yeah, I get. Oh. Right, cool. Did that just start this week? Treasure truck? No. Treasure truck's been around. Been around. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, I guess I just got the notification. Yeah. yeah. So if you just signed up uh, okay. recently, then this okay. is the first little notification that you would get. They have stuff uh -huh. on discount, and you can come over here and buy it and pick it up. The other is they set up events like this. So uh -huh. this is just this weekend. They just popped up the baby registry, and then they'll take it down this weekend. Okay, so the treasure truck is more like a, a driving advertisement. Yeah. Good they give know. you discounts, free stuff. Check out one thing. It's pretty cool. Baby. <sighs> we just scanned a lot of things for, for Amazon, but uh, we're not making a baby registry. And I've said this before, we don't like people buying us stuff. So we're going to buy everything on our own. We just have the... Um, notifications and see what products are out there and it's you know good for us and then we'll buy it ourselves okay mm -hmm. stopping by a goodwill donation center before we head home i think it's in that corner babe so giving away my clothes all the clothes that um don't fit and i uh 
didn't get responses from people so it's going out to Goodwill. I think they might filter through them. Not sure. It says no dumping. We're not dumping. We're donating. Your donations create hope, jobs, and futures. Should we just drop it off or just leave it anywhere? I guess. Just leave it here. Okay. Have them take care of it. All right. Okay, we're back home. Gonna get some soy milk and some medicine for my husband. He is back in bed and resting up, recovering from his sinus issue. Here, don't be a baby. We have to do this because we're not taking any chances. Do not want to go through this back and forth, back and forth. And my husband is being super pouty, but I really don't care. I really want him to get better. He exhausts himself all the time and works through the night, doesn't get any sleep, and then crashes and then gets sick. And it's like having my own big life-size baby to take care of. They're not easy to. <laughs> so we're we're taking the um, Aleve D. This really helps um, when you uh, have cold and sinuses. It's not going to cure your sickness, but it'll kind of hide the symptoms and make you mentally feel better. And then you can heal better when you feel better. That's just my motto. Better already. Cured. <laughs> okay. Thank you. I failed. I crashed for about two hours. <laughs> oh. mm -hmm. I'm going to try to stay up until tonight. Only a few more hours, man. You can do it. <laughs> so, um, I completely crashed for a moment and then somebody called me to book me for a show this month and I didn't respond back until waking up and they book someone else in the business if you don't respond within like i don't know half an hour they automatically like call someone else right away and um deals are usually done like in five minutes you don't get it done in five minutes then they're not gonna book you so um i got back to them and they were like yeah we needed a <laughs> we needed a singer for this month and i'm like yeah okay well let me know what your day and <laughs> and I'll, I'll um we'll work out a deal and then brian's like what the hell <laughs> I don't know, show. I'm stupid. <laughs> but I don't know. It's just habit for me to be like, okay, yeah, oh, I'm I'm available to work, and I think I can do it, you know. And I've got some really cute um, pregnancy wear clothing, and I'm only six months, so yeah. But you know, it's probably better maybe later down the line. Anyways, we're up right now, and I am trying my best to stay awake until night. I know I crashed for like two hours and I wasn't supposed to because I told myself that I gotta stay up and then get back on schedule because I don't want to get off. But it was just like out of nowhere, I just gone. And that's how I, that's how I get my sleep these days. Like I just have to exhaust myself to a point where I have no control. Yeah, so we're gonna try to stay up and um, grab something to eat. We only had chips all day. Right now it's about 8 p.m. We need to get something to feed baby Scooper. We had chips and we had um, all those juices. My husband's yeah, my husband's feeling a little bit better. He sweated out a lot of his um, illness. That's what happens when you're sick. You start your body starts to sweat a lot and soak up like the pillows and the bed and my hair. When I wake up, it's like soaking wet. So maybe it's like the um, sickness trying to exit your body. You know what I mean? And you have to rest mm. up and. Um, here. Like I can see sweat on his forehead. Let me see your forehead. Let me get closer. Oh, yeah. Right there. Do you guys see that? So his whole body is like fleshing out the um, sickness. So that's good. Gotta keep order. We're staying in today. I ordered some pizzas and uh, here is the, the one that Brian likes. This is uh, the Hawaiian bacon and pineapples and this one is the works which is everything these are small sizes and um, we got some chicken wings and over here we have some um, hot chili peppers and uh, crushed peppers going to watch a movie now and Brian's going to work you want something to eat not yet later 
Okay. All right, we're stuffed. We're full. Brian's doing law school right here, and I'm starting to crash. I think I succeeded in getting back on schedule. Okay. <laughs> Good night, guys.